Hi guys, I'm Chris. It's convenient to use a remote desktop to control your desktop in office, even where you are in home. My favorite is TeamViewer. The problem is that sometimes you cannot connect it because you forgot the password or something else caused access denied. In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix the TeamViewer access problem using another remote desktop. If you have a few computers in your office, and they are connecting together. If you are going to connect a Linux, you can use a SSH client. Open the SSH terminal in your window and then con connect it. You enter the local IP address and the user name of your remote computer. Connect. Enter the password. Now you are connecting it and into the terminal of the Linux system. Then we need a GUI in order to fix the team viewer. So for me, I have installed the X11 VNC server in my Linux system. So to launch the server, we have to type X11 VNC hyphen usepw in the ssh terminal and then press enter so now it's starting the vnc server in the Linux remote computer so let's see if we can connect the vnc so you can use ultra vnc viewer in your window enter the ip and try to connect it. So now you can enter the GUI interface of the Linux. Now you can use the GUI interface to edit the TeamViewer profiles. For example, you can uh, give a new password. So you can connect it again. So go back to the window and try to use the new password to access the, your remote computer. So it's success. So now can you now you can use TeamViewer to access your remote computer anywhere, no matter the setting of firewall. Thank you for watching.